to me. I think God beg you. I think God beg you even take you back God. Make you know where that Madame Claude again. Make you know cause trouble. Look at eh? Okreka. Yes. Okreka, please. Just leave me alone. Leave me alone. No, just that I, I am I, I am feeling your burden. You don't know say so your pain is my pain. I, I think you just know for me this time. Understand? It's not your punishment. Don't worry, very, very soon you stand your time was this on no day. My name is Desmond and yours? Roslyn. Wow, that's a beautiful name, I must say. And um, I must say you're very lucky to have a man like me. How do you mean? Yeah, you're very lucky to have a man like me because I'm a man of class. You know, quite classy. Yeah, actually, I'm very, very classy. And my friends call me Mr. General. Yeah, Mr. Generous, because I'm, I'm generous. And um, if you don't mind, I would actually like us to stop by somewhere there and have a drink. What do you say? Okay, no problem. What do you do for a living? Oh, actually you can see I'm a pilot and I'm just yeah. coming back from work. That's nice. You look good, you look good. Thank you. I like babes like you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, what a hectic day. Sir, please, I'm very sorry. I'm sorry for my actions the other day. I'm sorry. I know you and Madame are angry with me. Please forgive me. Oh, help me beg Madame too. Please, sir. Yes, Gemma. You're right, that we're very, very angry with you. Yes, we are. What you did was a gross disrespect of us. It is the height of disrespect. We deserve absolute respect from you, Chama. However, I accept your apology. But let it not repeat itself again. You will need to go and also tender a sincere apology to Madame. Okay? Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Unimaginable things. Please forgive me, ma. That means you are possessed. Possessed? I, I don't know if I'm possessed. But please, please, I'm sincerely sorry. You really, really hurt me. Firstly, I can't wear those clothes again. I don't share my clothes with anyone. And those are one of my favorite outfits. Well, my dad pleaded on your behalf. I really felt bad. I know you are the one I love most. It's fine. I'm forgiving you. Stand up. Thank you, ma. Just stand up. Hmm? Get up. Go back to your kitchen. Anyways, where's uh, Kate? She is washing. Call her for me. Thank you, ma. <laughs> You know that I love your daughter, passionately. 
You were even confessing then now, thank you. Eka, just because of that, I don't get credit. You will not believe Eka, I went to borrow car. I borrow. I went to borrow to call Eka. Eka was still insisting that, hey, okay, I'm buggy. you don't love me. Eka, you know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about? Yes? Eka, you should try to talk. Eka, let me call you back. Let me call you back, Eka. Why are you locking the gate now? Come, Eki. Uh, okay. Pass, go, you think I don't get I? You know, you, you think I don't have initiative. Is that what you, you, you think? Every day by day, look at Kula. You they carry Kula. You want to finish the food where this building. You know they go anywhere. Today, remember. Okay, Cancel. Cassie, I don't have your strength this afternoon. Please open this gate, let me pass now. I should do what? You want to drag the gate, we want to do gara gara. Let me tell you, this is not my duty post. This is my position. This is my working. No, take my work. Please make a no and bundle you. Uh, I, I take my basi. Beg you. So just carry the cooler. Make a no. I am, I am. You know, say, I, I know they like your own temper. When sun never shine. If my temper come now, now when sun come, now it go cool down. So you, 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 are, you are not going anywhere. Period. 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 Now, eh? Period. She be you my person. Oh, yeah, see. Just open it for me. When I come back, I will tell you everything. I will tell you that the carry and go here. Okay. Forget about person. Forget about person or whatever, but let me tell you, when the time go come, they know they tell him person, but they don't go tell you. The day we are go catch you red-handed. You go carry the consequences upon your head again. Eh, I go carry him, no problem. I go catch you. You go no carry him? I go carry him, open gates. Your wallet too much. Now you know get problem. You just they carry food for Kuna, they go give, even the boy away, they go give that food. That boy, if he gets someone when in love, you they love someone. Uh, someone where they love someone else. But in these girls, you don't you don't have orientation. You know, me, we we they here. Are we not handsome enough? You know it. Look, my spiritual eyes, this is how they trip for trip for you, God forbid. I would like trip for a person who carry cowbell factory. This one now uh, cowbell. This one now uh, three crown. Hear me. If this one carry this kind of thing, give picking, picking no go dead die. Picking go drink cowbell today, tomorrow go drink three crown. Next tomorrow, a few go bitter. Hello, pretty. Hello, Do you know you're such a beautiful damsel? Thank you. You know you're the most gorgeous I've seen in a while. Really? Well, baby, as you can see, <laughs> my name is Pilot Desmond. Actually, I work with the Safe Airlines. Wow. And baby, as I'm talking to you, I've made money. Like, real money. You know, if you walk down the street, you see a three-story building, well-built and furnished. Mm -hmm. This is just one of my buildings in Lagos. Are you serious? Well, baby, actually, I've been looking for, you know, cute and pretty damsels like you to spend my money on because I've really made money, a whole lot of money. So what are we then still doing here? You know what? We'll just go down the street right now. We'll look for any automobile. You point any car of your choice and it's all yours. Desmond? Desmond! What are you doing here? What are you doing here? I've been waiting for you at home to come take me to a business meeting. And you are here talking to a lady. Desmond! Is that how you waste the money I pay you? Look, give me my key. G give, give me the key. And look at you! And look at you! Hi. Mr. Coxon, so you're just a common driver and here you are washing down. Are you serious? My job is a stakeholder. And I've been here wasting my whole day. the girl I saw you with. Um, so she's actually the daughter to my oh father's God, Shut up. Who took the money I put in the pigeonhole? Sir, the money you kept... The, sir. Oh, shut up. Did 
You know, today I asked you to buy full tank. And you bought half tank and swindled the rest of the money. So these are the girls that milk you dry. Despond. You are a total failure. Sorry, sir. My protector, please deliver me from every strange spirit that visits me. Make me useful and obedient to those you have placed above me. Help me stay away from whatever that offends them. Take away every form of pride and greed from me so I can carry out my duties. With love, joy and happiness. Accept whatever future brings in good faith. Thank you, Lord. My Jesus name I pray. What is your name? Oh, Mr. Fred, sir. You are a driver with a good experience. Yes, sir. Good. But do you have experience in hunting, culture, uh, nurturing of plants and flowers? Because uh, that will be part of your work condition. Um, I'll try some. Good. Consider the job yours. Oh, thank you very much, sir. Thank you. Uh, the utility staff will take you around the compound and show you what to do with your job starts tomorrow. Um, thank you. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Um, I'll be by the compound. Of course, you cannot see that I am going out. But, sir, the thing is, I don't feel right about you going out. I feel something is going to happen. 
I perceive danger. I don't know if you can maybe stay home then go out any other day, but not today. I'll be fine, Joe. Besides, I have a lot of important things to attend to in the office today. Okay. But sir, uh, your life is more important. I'll be alright. Thank you. Whatever it is Joma is talking about is serious. Why not give it attention? What is Joma talking about? Like you not going out today? Um, I have very important uh, business to attend to today. But uh, no business is worth more than your life. It's your life we're talking about. All right. What is talking about my life? It's okay. Um, well, I'll take that. Now, you take this to Murphy. Okay. Hmm? Yes, uh -huh. well, he knows what to do. All right. All right. I'll do just. Hello, Murphy. Uh, good morning, good morning. Um, the driver, Fred, is bringing it to you. I may not be able to come out uh, because of uns unforeseen circumstances. So you go to Chief and get the delivery, okay? All right. Be careful. Okay. I've been thinking that yesterday I've been buying this back. Eh? Maybe yesterday I buy battery, I they tried to tune it in. I've tried to head within the album for a while, but I, I, I can't hear. I want to. My best friend, I even like know the how do I how do I listen to current affair? How do I listen? Yes. Guess what? What? You see that that chairman. That your mother, she has so much guts. Do you know she stopped Oga from going out? You see what I mean? Joma stopped Oga from going out. Exactly. Are you trying to tell me that Oga want to come out? Joma can say, hey, Oga, come back here, come sit down. What do you think you try to tell her? Not like that. I, I really don't know how she did it. The only thing I know is that Oga was ready to go out this morning. She walked up to him and told him some funny stories. If I knew it, Oga just walked back and relaxed. Just like that. I'm telling you, similar to the same thing she did the other day when uh, Madame was ready to go for an occasion. She had the guts to tell Madame not to eat anything at the occasion. But I don't want mom, Bazzi. She did that. That girl get guts. That girl where you see mbok, she get liver, she get kidney, she get... Can you imagine? That's some girl. You wear big like, you don't feel even open your mouth. Talk to... Talk, 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 talk. You people are talking about me. Be very careful because the walls are here. Yes. Who they talk about you? Who they talk about this one? But we, 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 do, do, do we, do we talk about this one? Or you just from inside house, you, your mouth they scratch you. You want to blow, blow whistle. And you think I don't know? Just be careful before you receive slap from an unseen hand. She know we are talking about. Can you imagine that one? That one thing you did, that one thing I just did here is surprise. How she take no? 
told you there is something about that girl. This one now, Yen Yaros matter. It, Spiritual slap. It is Yen Yaros. How she take yes. no? This one means everything. No one can talk any secret to body company. Everything now, now, code it, code it. Hey! She be, you don't see her. Spiritual ah. slap. Spiritual I think I'll make you don't condemn me this kind of thing again. I don't want to involve slap. In case you didn't want to backfire, make it backfire only you. Hey! Spiritual slap. You know where I when when I heard about spiritual slap last, now one half of it from my village, we've been there or tomorrow. You do give person person just they get spiritual slap, it'd be like baptismal class. You don't see where slap they shower like rain. I don't want to take that. No bring illegal news, come, 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 babe, you can listen to all wrong FM, all wrong FM point six point minus one, station seven, all wrong you know within there.
was not around when we got back, and still he's not he's not even back. I'm I'm sorry. Yes. Yes, guy. Come in. Yes, guy. Okay. You're back. Yes, dad. How are you? I'm fine. I'm yours. All right. I actually went to see the coffee. Oh, how is he now? Oh, he's fine. I thank God for using Joba to save my life. Yeah. This was your life the whole time. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I'm fine, I'm fine. Um, that I, I will join you downstairs. Let me quickly fresh up the place. I'll be there. Are you not satisfied? Is that how you take advantage of women when they are drunk? I never liked you. Because I knew you are not a good person. See, I, I tried to stop you, but you couldn't let me go. And I always do that. It's not in my nature to take advantage of people when they are drunk. Please, I'm sorry. See how foolish I am. The same thing I deprived the man I love so much. It's the same thing I gave to this foolish, stupid driver. Excuse me. Please, I'm sorry. Do not take me. But uh, I want you to understand this. And I love you. What's that just hear you say? I know you just believe. I know you just believe. I know you just believe that kind of nonsense. You know they even. They are new driver. <laughs> Common driver. Person where you just come, come back new. You know they say the way you just the chingum, the chingum, the chingum, or 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 he thinks there will ever be a lasting relationship between each other. You know they see the way in just the in just they follow Madame back to back. Anywhere where Madame go, you just the the judge come and like say like like where them pour sugar for grand in Tambolo, Congada. That boy get killed new. I just pray that one day a guy will catch them red-handed. Eh? Amen. See his small brain doesn't even know how many men, I mean rich guys that has come to this place to ask for this girl's hand in marriage. Imagine that. Imagine no that. Common driver that they just employed this day. Very, very common. You've seen an even Uber. Yes, sir. You know they take that and bring just they play with this. They play this for you. They find people. What's going on? We were just talking about the seasoning relationship between Madame and the new uh, driver. Driver. Huh? What's wrong there? Don't they have right to follow me? You think there's nothing wrong with that? Ha! That's very unrealistic. That Madame in all her glory is in love with a common driver. Driver? Common driver, Ochoma. 
As for me, I don't see anything there. <laughs> what is there if a rich man or a rich girl falls in love with a poor person? As far as there's genuity in their love, then I'm fine with it. But sometimes you both should learn to mind your business. If everyone day, if you are fine with it, but do you know if the father will, will be fine with it? Eh? Sometimes I don't know what's in the work. I don't know you understand. Conquering grammar. You can you imagine? You think you won't be. You knew it. You serve your own. Your own must serve. And I work fast. So you want to cause me? I've extended and through SMS. Very tiny. Just one stanza. Me, Mumu. If like say you know the SS, all these people who now you won't just carry confusion of that person thinking I'm I'm far out. Who shall be a new it? Who shall be me turn the way we turn the way the ampy the smell? Make the fire you idiot. You don't you know you don't get elderly you don't get elderly people for being a idiot. You don't you just say this thing now costume, now be a be and oh your papa feel you get something like this. Chama, I believe I have noticed something between Fred and I. We are in a relationship. What do you think? I see a sweet and lovely relationship in the beginning. In the end, the end won't be rosy. You have to pray now. What do you mean? I don't even understand myself. But that's what my spirit directed me to say. You have to be careful. You scare me. Just go ahead. I'm sorry, sir. Please, I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry, sir. This is what has been going on. Oh, Fred, I know you will not leave this house alive. I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry. sorry. We are sorry, Dad. We are sorry, Dad. Sorry. Dad! Say sorry to the devil when you get to hell. Dad! You said it is Fred! Fred! Why are you looking like this? Are you? Oh, no, I'm not. Who's wrong? I'm pregnant. What, what did you just say? I was feeling feverish, so I went to the hospital and the results shows that I'm pregnant. How now? Jesus, see, uh, please, what are you going to do about this? Because your father was not here about this. So. I don't know, I'm, I'm confused too, I don't know. Anna, please, please, you have to abort this, baby. See, for my life's sake, your father will not spare my life if he finds out about this, I beg. What? Fred! I can't do such a thing. I can't just do it. It can be dangerous. Nothing will happen to you. See, please, eh, you have to do this if you truly love me. Please. Don't <laughs> See. I don't think this abortion was behind the door. Why do you think so? It doesn't feel like children are doing up things, are doing up things. I don't just like what I'm feeling at all. Well, I think that's not what I'm just doing. No Yeah. I was told that many of these kind of things don't But don't worry, I'll go and see the doctor and 
and explain the situation to Sent for him. Fred, yes, go and wash the car and take him into the first press the battery. Oh, okay. There's something inside. There's nothing inside my shoe, Joe. There's something in there that if you wear it, you will die. Just don't wear it. Come on, check it yourself. Is there anything inside your shoe? your body and started eating you gradually and slowly till you finally die. But who could want me dead? Who have you offended? No one. I have not offended anyone. But how do you see all these things? And what is speaking to you? Well, I don't know, but maybe you offended. Choma! Choma! What are you doing here? Huh? What's between and this guy now? Let's go and continue what we are doing. To give me a no. Stay away from this guy.
Mr. Edward, your daughter is in a critical condition. But however, she's being taken care of. She's responding to treatment. But doctor, what actually is wrong with my daughter? You see, Mr. Edward, your daughter had the serious complicated abortion. No. Yes, that nearly damaged her body. No, you can't tell me that, Doctor. My daughter is a virgin. The last test we conducted on her still confirmed that she is a virgin. So, how can a virgin have an abortion? How? Mr. Edward, you will confirm that from her. Excuse me. You are the one that drives my daughter to everywhere she goes to. Now, tell me, do you know if she's seen anyone, any man or anyone outside? Um, none that I know of, sir. None that you know or know? There is no answer. about what I will do with the person. Just tell me. Annabelle. Annabelle, you don't want to talk? You are not talking to your father? Stay here with us. Now, tell me the truth. Is there any man that comes here to see my daughter Annabelle? Sir, we've never seen any man come here to look for her. You, Gemma? No, sir. Gemma, you usually go out with her. Does she see any man outside this house? Not at all, sir. We have never visited any man. All right. Now, you, 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 you need to monitor. And if you see anything like that, Tell me. All right. All right. All right. All right. Okay, you are the one 
that man's this gift. Tell me the truth. Is there any man that has been coming to this house to see Annabelle, my daughter? I mean, any man at all. I swear to God, I swear to man, as he wake with me, I have not seen anyone. I never see. Eh, Okabe, you know this, I, I, I remember. He just dropped into my memory. He gave one boy, one yellow, Idiot boy, where they come find your daughter, but now once once, you know, be regular. Now just uh, in tavern, you get. Do you know him well? And do you know where he stays? Oh, 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 uh, I don't know where this guy is, but I know him very well. If I see him just now, I can give account of him. I know him very well. Oh, okay, what things happen? They say, anytime this uh, guy come back, Whenever he come back, I me personal, I go catch him, give him, come call you come. Even though they say he never enter, I shall oh, really shut up. You are there, and someone, a man, has been coming to see my daughter, and you didn't tell me. Shut up. I said, shut up. Now, if the man comes again, make sure. You lock him in here yes, sir. until I come. Yes, sir. Okay, whenever she in, he enter. Even though the shadow first come, I will hold the shadow wait for the, the, the main body. I will make sure I hold him captive. Who oh, is? Okay, we do just that. Yes, sir. That guy where they will give me money, I will catch him for my order. He will think that he has become the super evangelist. We know that he is evangelist. Where is he? Let me call him. Where is he? Fine boy! Why I come back? No, you don't get problem. I will come, don't be me hide you for you. Who try to do like Uma Rapa? You want to do family business? You don't know you are. Come, will you come out from that place? Will you come out? Oh. 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 Go so, from make I don't give you slap. So you are the one that has cost this family. So much tears and anguish. No, oh, no, sir. oh, by the time I finish with you, you will not remember the day you were born. Oh, oh, oh. No, 
What have we done unto you? Hi. Oh, it's you. Hello? DPO, yes, it's me. Uh -oh. Please, please, I have a criminal right inside my compound now. I want you to send some of your men. Send enough men. Okay, thank you. Thank you. I only came to see Annabelle. I did nothing with her. Annabelle! Annabelle, please come and talk to your dad. I did nothing with her, sir. Please. Hey. I did nothing with her. I did so, nothing with her, sir. It's you. No, sir. I hey. only came to talk to her. Nothing. Dad, dad, please. please sir. He's my friend. Please, he did nothing. He's not, he's not a criminal. Please. He did nothing? Yes. And how did we lose? How the... Dad, he's not a criminal. He will go to explain at the police station. Dad, Sir. please. You must go to the police station to explain to the law enforcement agents. They must investigate you. Sir, I'm not, I'm not a criminal. Dad, you not, are. You not, are. I came to talk to him. Take him. him. When the police comes, friend. you bring him up. Take him inside. Dad, 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 there until the law enforcement agents arrive. Yes, then sir. you hand him over to them. Hoy, this boy did that. Huh? My only daughter. Yeah, okay, Mr. Okay, come, whatever your name is being called. Why did you set that guy up? And you know very well that that guy, is, that guy is my friend. Eh? Talk to me, why did you set him up? Madam, no, I, I, I didn't lose intention on him, but hmm. it wasn't intention, I did. Who is this for me? I, I really? really? If anything happened to that guy, I will hold you responsible. Nonsense. You didn't do it intentionally. You want to hold me responsible? Eh? Who will come there for a gate? Now you want to come there open gate? You want to hold me responsible? Did that guy where they did? Is he responsible? Person where gave behavior like people where they kidnap you, you will hold me responsible. He's not responsible. Where that your boyfriend there, number, then go down baby behavior by now. Now here to be skin punk. I am very sure of that. I can beat to my chest. Hear me. You don't know me where carry him? Pedrasas. <laughs> Idiot. He never see something. Idiot. Thunder fire you. Did they talk nonsense? <laughs> And what is it again? Why are you always making me uncomfortable to answer something? To you now. Now just thinking about the result. I'm scared. I'm scared I ain't even want that. This is my conscience like that. Annabelle her, she's my treasure and I cherish her so much. 
She must be a very lucky woman. Thank you so much. There is actually something that brought me here. Something I want to do. Okay. <sighs> Annabelle. Um, Annabelle. Please. Will you marry me? Fred? Yes, Do you really know what you're asking me for? I'm sure. I'm trying to express my, my gratitude. Please don't say no. Yes. Yes. I'll marry you. Yes. This is beautiful. Wow, congratulations Annabelle. You're very lucky indeed. This is actually a very huge step. Thank you so much. I'm lucky. Um, Thank um, you um, so much. Do, 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 do you want something else? I need trophy. Dad, guess what? I don't know anything to guess. What is it? Someone has proposed to me. That's nice. But did you tell him your health status? Yes, Dad. He's very much aware of everything. Oh, good. I would want to see there's a suitor who loves you. Even when he knows that uh, you cannot bear him, sure. I want to see him. Where is he? Dad, he's right at the door. Oh, go get him in immediately. from the hospital, Fred has been dead for me. Despite him knowing everything about me, yet he wasn't discouraged. Dad, I knew he truly loved me. Do you have strong reasons to trust him? That I am only concerned about your emotional and uh, the physical security. However, I will see to that. Thank you, Dad. That's all right. Good night. Good night, Dad. 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 Good I want to introduce to you, Fred, uh, my in-law to be. And from today, you must accord him the appropriate respect as my in-law to be. You must not refer to him 
as a driver henceforth. Okay? Yes. Right. yes. Because he is going to be my daughter's husband. All right? Thanks, Dad. Yeah. Thank you, Dad. Thank you. Right. Yes, sir. Good. Yeah. Well, I'm very happy for you. All right, Dad. I'm right. We got all good games now. Annabelle, please. He stopped crying. See, I'm, I'm very, very sorry for the embarrassment my mother gave you there. I'm much more embarrassed that the embarrassment had to come from my mom. But oh, please, I, I wouldn't want your daddy to see you this way. See, what I can assure you is that no matter what happens, I'm standing by you. In fact, our wedding plans commences immediately. But oh, please stop crying, please. Please. Annabelle, I don't want your dad to see you this way. Please. I'm, I'm totally sorry. Alright? Please cheer up. Let me wear your shoe. Everything went fine, sir. It was actually a warm reception. Thank God for everything. Mm -hmm. Annabelle. Dad? Did you like it? Yeah, I like the place. Like, wow, I really had fun. No. Is that? Good. Such a nice place. Uh, uh, so I really thank God for Johnny Messis. And I pray God that he will take absolute control of everything. Amen. Yeah. Yes. And um, how about your wedding plans? Oh, we are it. Okay. It's all right. You, you just just map out your plans and then you make them available to me. Oh, all right. Okay, all right. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Okay, yeah. now let me get a fresh up. Uh, mm, all right. I'm coming back. Good girl. Ah, mm. uh, fresh. Sounded so urgent. I hope you're okay. 
I mean, how could you? How could you have told the secret of Annabelle's health status to my mother? She gave Annabelle and I the worst embarrassment of our lives. Steve, I, could, I thought I could trust you. Hold it. What are you talking about, friend? You don't understand what I'm saying is what? Eh? You don't understand what I'm saying is what? You told my mother about Annabelle's predicament. And honestly, to, to be honest with you, I, I'm, I'm not happy about it. Steve, the last time I spoke to your mom was like 10, 8 months ago. Since then, I haven't called her again. I don't really know what you're talking about. Eight to ten months. So, if you did not tell her, who then did you? Honestly, I don't know. Maybe she heard it from another source or something. Like I didn't tell anybody else. I came to inform you about my wedding that is coming up. Please, I want you to be there. I will come to your wedding. As far as it's not that she man that you want to marry. No. I cannot attend a wedding of two men. I will only attend your wedding on one condition. Mama, the woman I want to marry is the woman I brought to you. Are you coming or not? If she is the woman you want to get married to, I will not come. Mama, can't you see we love each other? Can't you see? Hey, love. Love. Love that will not bear any fruit. What do you know about love? Eh? Love that you will regret tomorrow. You will not marry her. You will not marry her. You will not marry a man and call her a woman. You will not marry her. Mama, you say you won't come for my wedding. I will not come. If she's the woman you want to marry, I will not come. Mama, are you saying you won't come for my wedding? If she's the one, count me out. I will not come. So you will not come for the wedding of your only son? I will not come. My son want to marry a man. I will not come. Will not I come. don't want you to marry a man. I will not come. Mama, you will not come for the wedding of your a only son? A dry wood for a wife. I will not come. You are not going to marry her. You are not going to marry that man you call the wife. You are not going to marry her. My wedding, my wedding must go on. It must go on. We shall see. There's no problem. You want to kill me before my time, but it may not work. Came here by this time. I, I hope all is well. All is well, and there is no problem at all. No. Please, there is a favor I want to ask you to do for me. Sir. Yes. Mm. What could that be? Uh, please, I want you to come and stand in for me as my mother at my wedding. Stand in as your mother. And how? Why? What happened to your mother? See, my mother has refused to come. She said she will not come for my wedding. 
and there is no other person I can actually ask to do this thing for me except you. Please, Auntie. Please, a sum of um, 100,000 naira. Please manage it. Okay. You don't have to give me money. You don't have to give me this money for me to be at your wedding. Auntie, it's from my hand. It's not for us. I'm like a mother to you. What your mother is doing is no good. Eh? How can she refuse to be at your wedding? Her son's wedding for that matter. Ah. It's nah, alright. It's okay. I'll, I'll take care of that. But now, it's, my wedding is just the only thing that is watching me now. You don't, have to, you don't have to be bothered. You don't have to bother yourself. You're like a son to me. I'm like your mother. Eh? I'll, I'll, don't worry. I will try my best to be there. In fact, I will be there. Thank you so much. Okay. Don't have Thank to you. worry. Um, I will just um, be on my way. I want to see one of my friends. It's alright. It's alright. You will, my son. I will be there. You don't have to worry. Eh? Just go and get yourself ready. I will be there. Alright. Thank you. Right, bye bye. Go well. Do you know that Fred, my son, came back home to invite me to his wedding? Uh -huh. My goodness. <laughs> to his wedding, to that lady that does not have a room. God forbid. Which mother would attend such wedding? Oh. A wedding between a man and a man. Oh. Because that lady is a man. A lady that does not have room that can not be a child. She's a man. She's a man. I gave back to him so that I can carry my grandchildren. Do you know the most painful part of it is that despite all my warnings, all my threats, Fred went ahead with his plans to marry that empty vessel, that comb comb that nothing is inside. <laughs> <laughs> eh? Why is it that you know this baby have refused to listen to advice of their parents? I told him that I will not attend the wedding. Eh? Which mother would attend such wedding? And they forgot that now. If you can you know away from not a rigor no is one for queer. Oh fear. I told him that I will not attend the wedding. I will not attend. Hey. My now, sister, it's only God. It's only this heavenly God that will help me. Oh, gosh, it's God that will help me in this situation. My only child. My only child. Can't rock with you, So You don't have to worry yourself. You don't have to worry yourself. I will make sure that Fred doesn't get into that. You know he listens to me. Please, I'll talk to him. I will talk to him. Please. Talk to him to see reasons. It's okay. You don't have to worry yourself. It's okay. Can we get up? Bye bye. What, what's delaying you now? Who told me this thing will be ready this week? See, uh, my wedding is tomorrow. I don't want any stories. Okay, what about the cleaning van? Uh, come to the house now so we can load these drinks. I'm at home, I'm at home, I beg. And hey, where you from? Just. Uh, oh. Why are you doing this to me? Why are you paying me back with credits? Look, I, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. Tomorrow you are getting married to another woman. After all I've done for you. Fred, you know I love you so much. You've forgotten so soon how much I sacrificed to make and keep you. Hey, 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 hold it there. Hold your emotions now. 
See, we are adults. I don't, I don't want us acting like kids there. And I don't need to remind you what my wife would do if she comes out there and, 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 and find us in this compromising situation. For your own good, I think you should go back to your home. Say it with me. Congratulations once again. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. You are the latest wedded couple in town. <laughs> and I'm so happy for you. Fred. Sir. Now our family. Yes, um, I have bought a house for you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thanks, Dad. Thank, thank you so much. You will like it. It is palacious. Wow. You see it, you will know. Thank you so much, Dad. Thank it. you. So, anytime from now, you will move into your own house and leave as husband and wife. I've also provided an SUV for you to add to your. Thank you, Dad. Thank you, thank you so much. We like it. Thank you so much. Ah, thank you, Dad. Mercedes, you like it. Wow. Yes. So, Fred. Sir. Take care of your wife. I will. Annabelle. Dad. You love your husband. I'm the lawyer. are changing for the better. There has been elevations and more elevations will take place. Some positions will change and there will be additional positions. Meanwhile, our driver and gardener, Fred, has exceeded that position of driver and gardener he has moved to another level because he has become a bona fide member of this noble family as my in-law i want you to accord him the respect that he deserves i will not tolerate any insubordination to his person did you hear me yes sir yes sir um, today, they will be leaving this place to go to their own place. We have to employ another driver and uh, gardener. Kate will be deployed to them. Dad, uh, Choma is dead. Please. Right, I would have. Uh, loved uh, Chairman to remain here with me. Nevertheless, since you desire her, she will be deployed to you. Thanks, Dad. All staff remain subject and answerable to me. Okay? Okay, wait, no this. I want to suggest, suggestion. The new company where they want back go, they they get, get make you deploy me, make the workers get money there so you can employ new get man for this company. Oh, shut up. Shut up. And go to your to the post. What's all that? All right, you are dismissed. Oh, thank, thank you, sir.
Mama, what are you doing here? Mama, how can you be asking me what I'm doing in my father's house? Your father's what? Hey, Fred, so you went ahead to marry that empty vessel, eh? Despite all my warnings, hey, Fred, what did she give to you, eh? Mind you, you dare not bring her into this compound. I consider I never had a son like you. And you don't have a mother. Mama. You never had a mother. Mama, how can you say such a thing? Don't mama me. Don't mama me. I don't have a son. Mama, I don't like what you're doing. I don't like it. Fred! 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 Come back here. Collect this thing from me. Take this thing from me, Fred. I will beat you, Fred. I will beat you. Carry this thing from me. I don't need them. Carry it. Fred, collect it. I told you I don't have the sun anymore. Collect it from me. Collect it. Go. I don't want to see it. Go. I don't have the sun. Any that die, the Christian mother will come and bury me. I'm very happy for your family to the new house. I heard the place is very big. See? Now you're going to leave us behind. Mm -hmm. She now miss you. I'll miss the moments we shared, the fun, everything. We all have to adapt to the changes. That's what nature gives to us. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Well, I wish you all the best. Thank you. I'll miss you very much. <laughs> I'll miss you too. <laughs> all right. Okay.
that we tried our best. Me? Okay. But how is he now? Don't talk to us now. I'm sorry. He couldn't make it. Don't mama fret me. I'm just coming from your house. So you went behind me to attend my son's wedding, which both of us condemned. Eh, mama Nyaka, I thought you are a friend. I don't know that you are a snake. It's not my fault. You know, your son came to me. He was pleading like a baby. And uh, I had to, as a kind person that I am now, I had to attend the wedding. Mm -hmm. Yes, we both condemned his decision. But I did not condemn him as a person. Mm -hmm. and yes, and that was why I attended the wedding. <laughs> and you know what? <laughs> you needed to have been there. It was a fantastic one. Don't ever cross my path. Do you hear me? If it hasn't got into that, Yes, friend, too. Happy Rogo Rogo! Longer, longer. You're a very greedy it woman. Has not into you are that. a greedy woman. It wasn't my fault anyway. Your son, you refused to attend the wedding. And your son came to me. He pleaded yeah. with me. And I had to attend now. You will vomit everything that my son gave to me. For what? Please, today. Please, today. Here, what they see here. Today, you will vomit everything. No, one, yeah. You will vomit it. If not, I will beat you here. I'm and not. I will kill you here. I'm not you feeling fine. You I know you're not feeling fine. You like bribe, oh. you like bribe. You the only thing that my son gave to you, you will vomit it today. You will vomit it today, oh. Mama Nyaka, you will vomit it. Mama Nyaka, you will kill me. Here, what is here? Here, what is here? Everything. Is it my boat money? Boat to cloth. Everything. Kids, what are you doing here? Why are you crying? <laughs> Shoma, Oka is gone. Oka is gone. Hey, such a good man with a good heart. Eh? I don't know why, why good people like this don't last in this world. Oka, may your kind Buddha gentle so rest in perfect peace. Why did you kill him? What are you saying? Listen, don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about if you don't want everybody to know. So just answer my question. Why did you kill Oga? Hi, I did. But it was not my target. Then who was your target? <laughs> I wanted Fred dead. Fred? Why would you want Fred dead? I met Fred. I would like to Very nice. Thank you. Sorry, what was it for? You said he needed money to go back to the village. Oh. 
Thank you so much. I'm very happy I met a kind-hearted woman like you. But if you will help me, I want to stay back in the city and work. I want to make my poor mother proud. I am very hard working. I don't want to go back to the village. Okay. So, how do I help you? Accommodation. If you can actually allow me to stay here with you. As soon as I get a good job, I'll, I'll move out. <laughs> that will not be possible. I mean, we can't live together now. Besides, I have a boyfriend who paid for this accommodation and he comes here all the time. Uh, no problem. You can actually tell him I'm your brother that just came from the village. Baby, how are you? Hey, I'm fine. How are you doing? I'm doing good. How are you doing? Hey, good afternoon. Who is he? Um, baby, he's my elder brother, Fred. Okay. He came in yesterday from the village. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How is everything? Fine, thank you. And um, Fred, this is my baby, the love of my life. His name is Victor. Oh, really? I, I can see. I guess he's my supposed brother in law, right? <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah, you can say that again. Nice to meet you. Same here. How, how are the people in the village? Uh, <laughs> we are trying. We are fine. One of these days, you come to the village, so we will see you properly. You know, <laughs> as in law. I'm sorry for what happened yesterday. I promise it won't happen again. That's what you say all the time. After having me almost on Saturday night. <sighs> now you're gradually still in my hands. See, I honestly wish I could still talk to myself. I mean, not really kids. No, you're a woman with a heart of gold. I wish you could be my man. I've fallen for you too. But I just wish Victor was never in the picture. You don't need him. See, we, we can actually be managing for whatever you earn. And I believe very soon I'm going to get a good job. See what you do. Just look for a way to cause misunderstanding between both of you so he can live for good. Actually, get jealous whenever he comes here. How can I kiss him? Jealousy. Jealousy. Um, okay. I think about it. Just cause problem, let him go. Leave my house, Joe. Uh -uh. I told you I'm tired. Leave. Hey, who's this? I told you she's just an, an other friend to me. Joe, she's my friend now. Stop this, baby. I can swear to this. Just a friend. Just a friend that calls you morning and night. Please, just go and continue with her. I beg. I'm tired of this relationship. Baby, Leave. You, you, you just have to stop this. You have to stop this. Is that why you're shutting, hey, shut, my is house. That why you're shutting me off the house I paid? Please don't pay for me again, I can take care of myself now. Fred, but, but, but you, are, you are here listening to all this thing she's saying. Talk to her now. I love her I'm not set on all these allegations now. Boy, you just heard her say she's no longer interested in the relationship. Uh, go now. You have to talk to her. You're my guy. Talk to her now. Uh, Please now. I'm your guy. And she's my sister. Go out. Talk to her. Find a way and talk to her. Maybe I should go. Go now. Ah. Go to spoil something go. again. Go. I'll talk to her later. Fred. I'm your man. I'll talk to her. Take this um, 2000 for your keypad and take transfer around the central Oh, thank you so much. I'm grateful. We couldn't have done without you. It's okay. <laughs> Let me go back for my organic authority. I'll see you later. All right then. I said, get out now! I don't want to see you again. I'm very sorry, sir. Please, this is the handiwork of the devil, sir. I. Baby, it's for you. There is no problem. Um, there's a vacancy in my place of work. 
for the position of uh, the driver. Now, the guy just sacked his driver and he pays his drivers very well. But Are you serious? I, I don't know if you can drive. Well. Of course, now, why not? See, in my hometown, I am one of the most influential drivers there. I told you now. <laughs> okay. In that case, you have to go and apply right away. Mm. Most importantly, you don't know me. I don't know you. We don't know each other. Not talk of living together. I know why I'm saying this to avoid unnecessary suspicions. I think you're right. So I'll just bath. Go on. Bath and dress. Remember, you don't know me. Do I know you? Don't know you. Fred betrayed me. After all I did for him. Listen. You have to forgive Fred. I know what he did was wrong and it is an act of wickedness, but you just have to forgive him. I see a better man coming your way soon. A man that will give you love, peace and care that your heart desires. But you just have to forgive Fred and let him go. I am not interested. Fred will pay dearly for my tears. Can we let him go? So, did you try to confront him? Maybe by asking him why he's acting the way he's doing? I did. I confronted him the day before the wedding. Um, welcome by Thanks. How is work? Oh, work is fine. Thank you, Ivy. Fine. Welcome. Well, I'm here to make a formal presentation of a new statement of Mr. Edward Adams. We stipulate that the after three months of his death, the, the will, which is a which he signed as a legal tender should be read to the household. Um, Mr. Adams, what do you think of that? Um, I think it's fine. All my fixed assets, which includes houses, both in the rural and urban communities. All my business edifice, which includes my superstores, shopping malls, sales shops, all medium scale industry, the bakery, and my shuttle and transport buses and trucks and all my liquid assets, which includes cash at home, all my bank accounts, shares, bonds, treasury bills, be given to my only child, another Adams. All other litigation remains illegal and does not represent the real mind of the statutory owner of this will, signed Mr. Edward Adams. Thank you, Barrister. Hmm? We'll be right back. Baby, why is your face like that? Are we not one together anymore? <sighs> what belongs to me also belongs to you. <sighs> okay, fine. If we go back there right now, I'll tell the barrister to change the name of the, the name on the property to yours. Are you okay? Are you fine now? Okay. Let's 
头吧。Yeah. Freddy is my husband. I would like him to be in control of everything. I want you to change the name or the asset to his name. However, uh, I'll give you seven working days before we can effect a new change. We can ask it out that way. Okay. I'm embarrassed. Thanks. Okay, guys, I'm waiting for you. Waiting for your feedback. Oh, okay. Alright, you're welcome. Thank you. Alright, thank you. Alright. Are you happy now? You know, I always wanted to be happy. Kids, have you not done enough hard work? Shoma, stay out of this. I will not stay out of it. I know you may have your reasons, but does it warrant doing all this? Have you not done enough? Learn to pull yourself together, pick up your broken pieces and start a life. If you don't, the law will catch up with you and you will end the rest of your life behind bars. The one you did today, if you were caught, would you have time to plan another? Stop here, kids. You've done enough. Chioma, I warned you for the last time. Stop monitoring me. Stay out of my way. Stay out of my way. Kids. How did you not get to my, to my mom? Is that why you want to break my hand? Uh, I sent him to her. Do uh, you have any problem with that? You did what? You sent this to her. How did you get the result and how did you even locate my village? Have you forgotten I have your mother's contact? Of course I called her and she gave me the directions. How did you get this result? <laughs> what kind of stupid question is that? See, let me tell you. I know this house better than you do. Okay. Kate, you know what? I think I've had enough of your nonsense in this house. It's time for you to go. I said that I don't know. It's time for who to go. You come and push me out now. Jesus. This is just the beginning. You actually think you will mess with me and go scot free. <laughs> Fred, you have something else coming. Hmm? You just you, you've just activated the demon in me and I'll show you. By the time I'm through with you, you regret ever coming to this town. Nonsense. Work like. I'm back. Why? I don't like it. Look at 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 it. Um, first of all, thank you so much for your service. It's very, very hardworking. Um, this your pay also. Uh, as you can see, my dad is late and we can no longer afford the service of two minutes. So, you have to stop work after two minutes. Okay, thank you. 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 
For nothing. She just gave you a good reason for her decision. Now, what's the point for again? He just told her why we don't need her anymore. Go now. She even gave you a huge amount of money. Yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, well, okay. Madam, there is something I wanted to listen to. I'm sure you will like it. So, can I listen to it now? Um, I'll be right back. You like it, right? Very nice. Very nice. Um, so yeah, I'm actually pressed. Can you use the pressure? Oh, really? I'll, I'll join you. Oh, okay. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What is it you want to play to my wife before you leave? I don't think you want to hear it. I want to hear it. Can you remember what you told me the first day I accosted you when you started developing this fake feelings for my madam? So, can you still remember now? No, I don't remember the past. Okay. nonsense going on between you and Madame Annabelle. Madame Annabelle, I don't understand. You're just a bloody liar and a pretender. Don't you know it's so obvious that you are both in love with each other? <laughs> in love? God forbid. I mean, how could you even think I'll, 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 I'll feel anything for, for a woman like that? Oh, because you feel because her father is now wealthy, she will be exactly what I want. See, I don't know what I'm doing. I want to get this girl to fall in love with her. Then I'll use that as an opportunity to exploit her and her father. So if eventually her father dies, I'll get her to change all the names in the documents to my name. Eh? So that you and I can take the money and run away to a party where we'll enjoy life to the fullest. I don't know what I'm doing now. Mm, uh. Are you very sure of what you just said now? Wait. Just sit down and watch me do this. I don't know what I'm doing. I have all these things planned out. See, I don't want them to... See you Pray. Pray. Okay. If I'm jealous, so. So, don't you tie your You are a devil. Because only devilish people keep evil records. And you are a saint. Because only earthly saints like you forget kind gestures. I really cannot wait to play this for your loving wife. She needs to know the kind of husband she's married to, to know her husband's plans. So tell me, now that you have succeeded in killing the man, what's your next plan? Kit, why are you doing this? What do you want from me? Good question. I want Choma sacked while I remain. You want Choma sacked? Of course, you know that is not possible. Hmm. In that case, your wife needs to listen to this before I leave. You are a saint. A saint. My love, can I ask you for a favor? Um, yes, of course, go ahead. I feel we should retain Kate and let Choma leave instead. That is not possible. Why the change of decision all of a sudden? 
Oh, my darling, see, I feel so much for Kate. From all indications, it seems she's feeling so minimal with this job. And it won't be nice if we leave her without any source of income. What happened to those people that she takes care of? So I'm actually suggesting maybe we... Chima will leave instead. No. I'm not really sure if you can understand what you're saying. Chima is more useful in this house more than Kate. And my father will not even be happy in his grave if I send Chima away. See, please. I can't please you to displease my dad. No. I've not asked you for a favor before. Uh, please do this for me. I'm sorry, I can't. I can't. Uh, and that is my, my that is final. Please, I, I can't do it. Please. Can't you go? Uh, I think you need to think about it. I don't need to think about anything. I have made up my mind. Can't you go? Please, just respect my decision this time around, please. I told you. Wow. I told you. Wow, that's true. See, this guy is almost good or something. Great. Madam. I'm ready to leave. Oh, that's good. I want to thank you so much for your love and care throughout the period I worked for you. Yeah, you're welcome. And uh, what about what you... Um, Kate, you, you can go inside and drop your things and continue your work. My wife and I said that you return your job. All right? Um, Choma! Choma! Okay. Please come. <laughs> what's, what's, what's going on? What are you saying? Okay, come. Um, yes, I did. See, you, you go inside now and pack your things. You leave today because my wife and I can no longer afford the services of two maids. Alright? Oh, what are you talking about? I, she can't just leave. Uh, Kate, uh, you know what? Uh, you give her that envelope that was given to you in the morning, alright? Choma, please go inside and pack your things. You're leaving today. I cry not for my job, but for the sorrow that will befall you. What, what are you doing here by the time of the evening? Because I need to discuss something with you. You want to talk something with me? Yes. What not be that? What, what, what is it? Africa, I remember you told me how you were frustrated on the road. Then our late Oga picked you up and offered you this job. He even paid you more than what gatekeepers collected. You also told me that he has been more than a good man to you. He is a, a very good person. Very, very good. In that case, we must reward him both in life and in death. But how will one take you to that one now? Eh? What, what do we do? 
the wolves have been around this house. And people like you and I, who benefited from his kind gestures when he was still alive, would not let their plot succeed. We must do something to stop them. Well, what do we want to do now? What people be the wolves? Can you tell me the people? Make her know them in person and make her know my own role to play. To the fight wolves the... are people that you and I know. And your role is to get me inside that house and play along with me. You have to take you inside the house. You know what will happen now? This thing I want to do now, I want to take risky. But I will do it just for you. You get. I go carry you go inside because nobody don't come now. You, you understand? We, we, we need to make her just go hide you now. Sharp, sharp. What are you doing here? Why didn't you know before coming in? Oh, please. Tell me all that process. Um, I saw your wife driving out. Where is she going to? I don't know. Maybe she went to look for trauma or something. I don't know why she needs that girl so badly. Too. That's her business. But, so, why are you here? You've succeeded in sending trauma out of this house so you can continue with your de deadly plot. Come on. No more evil plans now. At least not now that everything is going well as planned. According to your boys, your family is gone. Yeah? The man is gone, the will and document is in your possession, so I just want to have you all to yourself. I, I don't know all what you're talking about. <laughs> I know you look more handsome when you come home. Hmm? Come on, why don't you come and give your young abandoned baby a kiss? don't have time. I have to sell these properties and get the final properties in our name. Okay? See, tomorrow we'll go to see the two houses on your country. How did you get to know about these properties? <laughs> Please stop asking me stupid questions and give me more moral ground. Another round of Oh, come on! You can't be conscious now. Jesus, I'm tired. Tired? Yes. Do I, 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 like I, do I look like a horse to you? I have a wife and I'm doing extra, extra one. You, you, you want another one? <laughs> like I care. <laughs> By the time we sell the properties, we'll kill you and marry a more handsome and good gentleman. Sure. So definitely find out for who.
This can be true. It's true. That's the voice of your husband before you got married. And that was his motive for marrying you. He loves me so much, I can't believe it. Chuma, where did you get this from? I, I can't believe this. You really can't do this to me. Who has this voice? Can I see those documents you collected from the barrister? I want to check some things. What is it you want to check? I just want to check some things, that's all. That's why I check up for some things. Oh, you can't have it. Why are you sounding like this? I said I want to check and confirm some things. Is, 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 is it not my father's properties again? And don't forget I'm the man of this house. I decide what happens as far as the documents and properties are concerned. Baby, why are you sounding this way? I was the one that decided to change the name to the document to yours. And so what? Like, and so what? See, if you don't have any other thing to say, I I'm very busy here. Something I want to tell you. What is it? See, I, I don't have power for anything. It's not that thing, Joe. It's easy. See, 
I suspect that Choma is somewhere in this house. Choma in this house? Mm -hmm. How possible is that? I don't know. I have this strong feeling that she's in this house. I think we should search for her. Get your stress in I don't understand that. This is not stress. I know what I'm saying. Let's just search for her. God help you. Here if you should. Why did you not give me fake document? I never knew you're a gold digger. Overheard what Annabelle said. Annabelle is just carried away by her emotions. I perceive some foul play in what is going on. I don't trust that man. If he's really sincere, then he can control everything without wanting change of ownership. Sir, remember you are her father's personal lawyer, and you owe her a duty to guide and protect his will. That's why the father entrusted you with this will. Please, do not do it. Listen, this is what you will help us do. Keep the original papers, then maybe you can come up with something. Something that's unauthorized and illegal. 
So by so doing, he will believe he has the valid papers of properties. Please. You have such a smart idea. It's very thoughtful of you. There could really be a foul play. Yes. Somewhere. And um, the fact is, a, it's a very, very bright idea of yours. Well, in any case, I'll get back to you. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. All thanks to Chioma, who uh, uh, reminded me that gold diggers like you still exist. Mr. Fred, you have to refund all the money that I paid for the purchase of that house now, or? You just have to give me some little time. I'll, I'll give you the back. What is just a state? What is really going on here? I arrest this lady here, Kate, for the murder of Chief Edward. What are you talking about? What are you saying? Kate here is responsible for the death of your father. Choma told me everything. Kate! You killed my father! It was not intentional. She, she wasn't my target. Fred was my target. What? What? Kate. What? what? <laughs> Officer! Arrested! Take them away. Mr. Fred, I, I am not going to arrest. Let's go. Uh, Officer, we are talking about somebody that just killed somebody. That's a more grievous offense now. Let us analyze this thing very properly. It's not intentional. You wanted to. You are the, the court report. So you wanted to. Is, is it not your greed? Is it not your greed? No, it's not your greed now. I will kill you that set. Um, I beg you, I not do this demo. Now that man they pay my salary, no go beat your hand break. Make it no be sign signature. When I am go take money for them, you can break his leg, but just leave the hand. Kate, you can destroy her future. I don't know. You can do it. 